thing about orchestra when it was uh, established? Or is it ad hoc orchestra? The choir. The choir. <coughs> yes, the choir. Is it ad hoc or it has been existing for some time? When the, and where and why it was uh, established? The St. Sophia uh, Greek Orthodox community of Washington, D.C. Um, was always uh, trying to establish um, a Byzantine Orthodox service as much as possible, uh, since many other parishes uh, have uh, inserted uh, uh, Western type of worship, including organs and uh, four-part harmony choirs. Now, St. Sophia, since 1904, has been uh, trying to find uh, expressors of, of this Byzantine art and is probably, if not the only one of the few parishes that still have a ministry of Byzantine music, an office of Byzantine music that uh, trains uh, a Byzantine choir throughout the service from the morning service to the Divine Liturgy and the Eucharist, all in Byzantine music. And this is because we want to be faithful to our roots and to the uh, Byzantine tradition of uh, Orthodox worship. Um, do you sing in Byzantine? We only sing in Byzantine music, although we sing in Greek, English, and depending on the uh, congregation, sometimes a few hymns in Arabic as well. Can you tell me the profile of the members? What, from where country, what country they are coming? Well, uh, all of our parishioners are Greek Americans mostly, and uh, uh, a lot of Americans as well, uh, with no affiliation to the Greek culture. Um, however, they all follow our traditions uh, very easily, especially at the Greek festival when we have much food. We come every time of year <laughs> to get food. Um, okay, what can you tell me about the choir, about the membership? Now, uh, the choir uh, was established back in the early 40s when uh, uh, a, a Byzantine chanter started uh, gathering people to sing for the services. Now, since then, we had a lot of other psaltes here, and uh, the recently deceased uh, Harilaos Papapostolu, who had a choir of almost 100 people on a Sunday. Of course, not everyone attended th the service, uh, but there were uh, members of uh, all around the, the Washington, D.C. area, Maryland, Virginia, and Washington, D.C. And they established this choir, and since then, it's been existing.